Hello everyone, welcome back to Trek A Day, moving on to number 41 of my 50 favorite Star Trek characters. We have another favorite recurring Klingon, Gowron. The man who at times was as crazy as his bugging eyes, Gowron was fantastic. He was a character who could be very serious and aggressively traditionally Klingon but at the flip of a switch, be absolutely hilarious and easygoing, and he worked in both ways so beautifully, flowing between the two, and why I think I really came to enjoy his character so much, not just because every time he came on screen he was a joy to behold, but because of the journey of that, that character from when he's very first introduced, and seeing his his rise to power as chancellor and then seeing his time as chancellor and then seeing the downfall and seeing that whole journey of that character through TNG and DS9 especially as it relates to the journey of Worf and a lot of their connections and Martok as well on DS9 I think what I loved about that character, besides just being a, a very fun and entertaining performance every time, was seeing his journey and how it very much paralleled how the Klingon Empire would go through a massive cultural change from the corruption at the time that he came into power in TNG to the Empire trying to have to many ways culturally restructure and rebuild a lot of things under Martog and the assistance of Worf in the post-Dominion War era. And he was just one of those real character characters who you couldn't help but enjoy watching. I think one of my favorites, and I love a lot of the, again, the big dramatic political and wartime, more serious issues with Gowron, but I think my favorite moments with Gowron are all the more comedic moments. The House of Quark is probably one of my favorites. Uh, just anything more comedic driven with Gowron seemed to be, the, the scene seemed to just work and be enhanced by his presence. <laughs> 